For all wiring scenarios, here are some things to keep in mind. All emergency lights must be on the same circuit and fit the power rating. Use either 120 or 277 volt lines. The input and output voltage must be the same. Here's how to wire lights connected to multiple 010 volt dimmer switches. In this example, we have more than one zone. Each zone has multiple lights that are controlled by a dimmer switch, including an emergency light in each room. Since there is more than one dimmer switch that needs to be connected to the mini inverter, 010 volt compatible transfer switches must be used to override the lighting control devices. A transfer switch must be installed for each dimmer switch. Transfer switches can be installed beside wall switch, light fixture, or mini inverter. Wire the unswitched input on the mini inverter and all transfer switches to the electrical panel. Wire the transfer switch to the dimmer switch in each zone. Wire the electrical panel to the lights that are controlled by the dimmer switch but will not be used as emergency lighting. Wire the mini inverter to all transfer switches and connect each transfer switch to the lights that will be used as emergency lighting. Wire the lighting control override line to connect each transfer switch to the dimmer switch and to all the lights controlled by the dimmer switch in each room, including the emergency light. When AC mains power is on, the lights in each zone are controlled by the respective dimmer switch. When the main power goes out, the transfer switches will bypass the dimmers so that even if a dimmer is off or down, the lights wired as emergency lighting will turn on at full brightness, powered by the mini inverter. For more information about mini inverter electrical designs, contact technical support.